29. The following concentrations are found in mixtures of ions in equilibrium with slightly soluble solids. From the concentrations given, calculate the KSB for each of the slightly soluble solids indicated. So we have GD2SO43, that's the slightly soluble solid, but it's a solid nonetheless. And it's going to produce its two ions, and they told us what the concentration of each was. So for the GD3+, plus, I have 0 0.132 molarity, and for the SO4-2-, minus, uh, SO4 minus, the sulfate ion, I got 0.198 molarity. Okay, from this information, we just got to calculate the KSP. And remember, KSP has always come from the balanced equation. We're always going to start off with that solid and break it down into the two ions. They gave it to us already, so no guesswork. I'm just going to use what they gave me. So we got GD, 2, SO4, 3, and this comes to equilibrium because we're dealing with the K value with the two ions. So GD, 3 plus, plus SO4, 2 minus. I have charges, so that's aqueous. Keep in mind that this is the solid, right? The slightly soluble solid, but it's a solid nonetheless. Now we just have to balance. There's two GDs, so I need a two in front of the ion, and there's three sulfates, so I have to put a three in front of the sulfate. Now I'm just gonna write out the concentration that they gave me. So for the GD3+, plus, I have 0 0.132 molarity. Take note that I do not multiply it by two. This is the overall concentration of all of the GD3 pluses that you have. So whatever they told you, that's what, you know, that's what's given. No more, no less. Same thing for the sulfate. This is the number that they gave me, the 0.198. So I do not times it by three. I just have to take that for all of the sulfates. Combined is 0.198 molarity. Now I'm going to take the general KSP formula and just use my balanced equation to get a specific KSP formula, right? KSP just equals to the products raised to the coefficients. So KSP equals concentration of GD three plus times the concentration of the SO4 two minus. So let's just raise uh, each one now. Keep in mind that you had two GDs so I have to take my GD concentration and raise it to the second. I had three SO4s, so I have to take my SO4 concentration and raise it to the third. This concentration, just like they told us, 0.132 molarity. The sulfate concentration, they told us 0 0.198. So I'm just going to use the numbers and plug in and solve. KSP equals... Let's see what we got here. 0 0.132, that's raised to the second, and then 0 0.198, that is raised to the third. Plug this all into the calculator in one, one shot. If you feel more comfortable doing it in parts, that's fine with me. Let's just see if our answers match. K, SP, the solubility product, equals 0.132, raised to the second, times 0.198, raised to the third. And three sig figs for this one, 1 1.35 times 10 to the negative fourth. And that's your solubility product, that's your KSP. Cool beans. All right, not bad, what do you think? I really hope this helps. Let me know in the comments, subscribe to the channel, and I hope to be uh, hearing from you guys, I guess in the comments section, in the next video. <laughs> okay. Um, I will talk to you all later. Have a great day. Bye-bye. And if you want to help us out, please press the subscribe button. Thank you. Okay. Bye-bye.